Gaijin TV. We're here at Shintaro Sasabe's house in Okamoto. Now, he dead now, but in 1981, what was it, Showa 56, they turned the residence or the, the property into a Sakura park. There's somewhere between two and three hundred varieties of Sakura. Now, we're a little early on the blossoms, but we're going to go have a boo through the park and show you some of Sasabe-san's work. This is the same dude that did the entire Sakura Shukugawa, the Shukugawa River Valley. So it's beautiful designs. And hey, you wanna check it out? Come on. Okay, so here's the front entrance and a little plaque for a dedication. And we gotta turn around and do a drive-by. Just a little north of the station, as you can hear, that's Okamoto Station on the Hankyu line. Let's have a look at the buds. Well, they're coming, but still about a month away. Okamoto's mighty pretty little town just nestled in Kansai between Osaka and Kobe town. This is probably the main event tree and they got a beautiful photograph plaque of him in full bloom. My boy Anthony throwing his girly in the river. <laughs> Not yet. And there's that girl in full bloom. So like I said, the blossoms come in first is peach, I believe, then the ume or the plum, there you are, and then the sakura. So there's actually a famous ume uh, blossom park up the hill. So we're gonna go check that out for you. Check out Anthony picking up a little garbage. That's nice of you. What a gentleman over here. Show me your garbage. Oh, you're beautiful. Okay, here he goes. I cannot and I will not pass this by. It's amazing the, what they do and how the, well they do it. And we're gonna ride through it. The smell, ladies and gentlemen. Ah, fresh cut pine. Yeah, it's like a carpet. That's sweet. Uh, once again, video does not do smell, so wish you were here to smell it. Check out the gate, they've even got a roller. Spring loaded. And stay out! 